Welcome back everybody. I hope you're all doing well. We're returning to the southern mid-latitudes of Mars to Neradum Montes in the Argaia Planitia region. The high-rise photograph in this video is called Gullies and Pasted On Material. How weird is that guys? Gullies and Pasted On Material in Neradum Montes. Rather strange description for this photograph. Acquired on the 21st of August 2009 at a low res of 55.3 centimeters per pixel. Not the 25 centimeters per pixel we used to folks, but you can make out the detail in these anomalies. I'll be showing you images cropped from the JP2 black and white map projected file just over 180 megabytes in size. There's a look at the low res JPEG and the anomalies I'll be showing you are some of these white specks that you can see on this elevated terrain. So the site we're looking at is on the northern ridge of Argaia Planitia at 43 degrees 13 minutes south 49 degrees 56 minutes west. So the first rather strange arrangement of blocks we're looking at here yeah, folks you can see them right there there's one two three four five six seven of them in a row look at the spacing between those and then at a right angle we've got a couple of blocks going this way. So let's have a look at that this line is about 50 meters long and you can see the spacing between those looks rather odd folks. More blocks are discovered in Argaia Planitia folks check these out. Lots of symmetry and geometry going on there. We've got two long blocks next to one another and next to each of those we've got two similar blocks as well. Lots more in that photograph. Check out that video if you get a chance folks. The piece you can see over there guys is about 25 meters long and a close-up reveals it's got this strange shape to it. It looks like some type of metal and it's been ripped over here in the center or could that be an opening? It looks like some type of wreckage. And there's another piece that I found also with this bent up shape to it. This was in a Newcomb on Mars. So rather strange, got this triangular shape with this long narrow piece on the top and it crumbled up. And then the other two pieces there, folks, this piece is about 10 meters across, about 90 degree angles to it, and this is rather strange, it got like a dome on the top, and these three dark spots arranged in a triangle, they're the same size, and this T-shaped piece next to it also looks rather out of place. This is very dark folks, but you can make it out when I zoom in. This piece is about 12 meters long. Check out the right angle to it. And then these parts on the top arranged parallel with this one side. And then we've got three slightly raised dome-like parts over here to the right. And there's another piece, almost like it, a lot brighter though. We've also got these three dome-like raised areas on the one side and the two parts in the center. There they are to compare. But the two parts over there on that one and over here on this one. And then the three raised parts on the side. Yeah, we've got something similar. This is in my video called More Ancient Structures Discovered in Ogiges and Day, where we've also got three similar parts 
on the edge and two smaller parts on the top. And then this strange opening in the side of the gully, this is about 50 meters long guys, but what makes this weird is the arch like shape and it looks as if this is a different type of material to the part sticking over the edge. Wonder if this is an unnatural opening. Check that out folks. The material I've here is also a lot brighter. So could it have been excavated in the recent past? And then we've got these rectangular blocks over here on the one side. There's one, two, three, four, five, six of them there, folks. Looks almost like a type of a ramp. Who knows what's going on there? Okay, let's go down to Argaia Planitia to the site in Anaradum Montes. Let's look at the anomalies just briefly. This object, that one, are very, very similar. Right, let's check what else is close by. This is more to the south. We've got uh, more parts that look like wreckage. This piece of here looks like it has a hole and whatever plugged that hole is lying here on the left hand side. Also we have these four parts around that hole. It's rather weird. And then these pieces seem to be piled up on top of one another. Let's go up to the north. This is where one of my channel subs found this strange part and it looks as if it's on top of a rectangular base. So it's got these boulders packed at an arc leading over here to the top left. And there's an outline of what we see there, folks. And there's a similar object that I've featured in the past. This is over at my blog, folks, where you can find all the original images I feature in my videos. And you can also use the video names to do a search to find those images relatively easily. So there's the anomaly, and there's another one I found that looks a lot like it. It's also got the, it looks like it plugs onto something and this looks like a wrecking ball. It's weird. And that's it for this one. Let me know what you think of these folks. They are weird to say the least. Not the typical megalithic blocks with protrusions or knobs that are normally feature. Let me know what you think of these. I look forward to reading your comments and analysis. Until we see each other again, take care. Ciao for now.